Welcome. This is the first official podcast of the Chaz and Jimmy uh, Entertainment Review. We're going to come up with a better yes. name. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully later. Yeah, but but for now, it is what it is. So we're basically going to discuss... Whatever the, the fuck we want to talk about. Exactly. The entertainment world will probably be a main uh, main component of this, so if you're not interested... Mostly anime. Yeah, if you're not interested in obscure animes and foreign adaptations or and their any, relevance. Yeah. Or just any obscure, weird movie. Exactly. So, uh, I think I want to pitch the first conversation. How do you feel about M. Night Shyamalan directing the... Uh... Avatar. Yeah, what do you, how do you feel about that? I think that's utter crap. Seriously, he hasn't done a... Ser- honestly, between you and me, he hasn't done a good yeah. movie since The Sixth Sense. It's true. I mean, The Sixth Sense was awesome, and then to me it's like he just all of his talent disappeared instantly. Yeah, basically. And after that, it's... Uh, you know, Unbreakable. Yeah. No. Signs was decent. Signs was okay. I like Signs The Village, lot. you can watch it once, and then it sucks every time after. Just getting the mic closer to us. All right, there you go. Right. And uh, the that happening. The mic. <laughs> Have you seen The Happening? No, I haven't. I heard it wasn't that good. <laughs> well, it's good for a laugh. All right. Then I need to check it out sometime and rent it from Netflix. Don't buy it. Yeah, that's true. Don't buy or, it. Or, or just download the camera. So, Astro Boy, your take. I haven't heard a lot about it. You probably know a little more I than me. I think that might be decent. I mean, I heard... I don't know a whole lot about it myself, but I heard that Nicolas Cage is doing some voices, and it's not going to be live action. Yeah. It's just going to be... Which helps it. It's going to be... Yeah, that helps it. <laughs> It's going to just be CG, so, you know, if they get the right, right voice actors and mm-hmm. they stay true to the original, I think it would do good. Well, let's be honest. I mean, it, it works as a children's film. Oh, yeah. It, I mean, it's, it's it, a fun movie. Well, if they do it right, it could be like most of those children's films where, exactly. you know, adults get interested in it. And let's be honest. Pixar's monopoly on CG animation needs to stop. Somebody needs to make something worth it. Yeah, but I don't, think, I don't think that company's going to do it. Imagi or something yeah, like that? Yeah, you're probably right. Imagi, uh, yeah, it was Imagi. yeah. I've, I've, until now, I haven't heard of them. They're also supposed to be doing Voltron. Yeah. Another like another anime. Thing. So you're getting official. You're getting an official uh, cautionary optimism for me and Jimmy. You know. Yeah. Be cautious about this movie, but uh, who knows? It might be good. Yeah. Exactly. If, so. it, if it sucks, it might be. It might be like the Dragon Ball movie. And yeah. You can just go so, watch the laugh yeah, at it. Yeah. It might be and so piss bad. Then on the screen once you're done. Yeah. It might be so bad that you go there just to laugh at how poorly they did, you know, they adapted this. Speaking of Dragon Ball Z uh, oh evolution, oh god, we're gonna have to get in a tirade here, people. Okay, I was a big drag. I don't know about you, Jimmy. I was a big Dragon Ball Z fan. Oh god, when, when I was seven and eight. Same here. I have not seen the film, but from what I have seen in commercials, I'm sadly, okay, that 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 isn't even covered. I'm I'm disgusted. This is bad. Are there yeah. any? Are there any big names at all in it? Uh, Chun Yao Fat, but he can't. He's he's Master Roshi. Oh really? Yeah, I haven't seen it yet myself, but from what I've actually heard, he even sucks in it. <laughs> oh shit! Well, I mean, it's, I just don't think they had any effort. There was no inspiration. They probably knew how bad this movie was gonna be. Yeah. You know. Well, you know. If it's Fox, they, they they do they do good things and they do crappy things. Well, that's true. I mean, you know, a Fox as far as underground goes, I'll watch them. But when it comes to mainstream, I'm kind of. That's what they did with that's what they did with Dragon Ball, trying to make it mainstream. And... Yeah, I mean, Dragon Ball's not really a mainstream well, actually, show. Well, actually, then again, Dragon Ball's pretty mainstream. I mean, look at when it was on TV; it was really well, huge. I, I was gonna say though, I think it's one of those underground shows that just happened to get it. They should have just kept it the same way. Yeah. Because, I mean, like, in this, they, they change it to completely, like, it's like high school-based yeah, setting. Yeah, exactly. That, that, what I'm saying... It's yeah, like one of those yeah. cheap, generic, you know, fighting movies. Like, when you think about it, I mean, I don't think they made Dragon Ball Z, the people who did the original anime. I don't think they intended... Well, I mean, they wanted it to, but I don't think they they thought, you know, or foresaw how big it was going to get. Yeah, they, they didn't. And once it got that big, somebody said, you know, ooh, money, let's fuck a series over. You yeah. Know? I mean, that's well, a common thing. Well, it started out big, and it stayed true to the manga, you know? Yeah. And then once they realize, oh my god, this anime is doing great. Which, which I've never read the manga, but I do hear they're very true to each other. Uh, starting out, it's true. Then it becomes then filler. It, yeah. Really wow. quick. And, that, and then, then the fights take like 15 episodes long. Well, that, this is true. But there were some awesome but you know, fights. You know what they're doing, though? What are they With doing? With Dragon Ball in Japan, they're actually redoing it. The entire series. And they're mm. slimming it down. What they're doing is they're slimming it down. They say that they're going to fit the, all Dragon Ball Z stuff within 100 episodes instead it's, of like 300 plus. Yeah. 
as far as slimming down goes, it works sometimes, but if they take out the wrong things, then it can be a disaster. It's one of those right. things that can be go either way. Well, I seen the very first episode of it, and they did slim, they did trim it down a lot. Like you remember how, like well, you probably don't remember, but at the beginning, it's been a while. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while. You don't actually see uh, Goku's brother until like the third or fourth episode in. And this yeah. time, you go through that whole thing with Wait, Goku's brother within. What did his brother look like? I probably remember who you talking about. His name was. Uh, it just looks like a, like you know how like Goku has all like, really mm -hmm. weird spike hair. Yeah. We'll take that spike hair and just like flip it down and all the way down to like his oh, butt. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I, I think his name was Raditz. Yeah. Really weird who, name. What was the little guy's name? I forget. The little guy with the bald head. Yeah, the little uh, bald head. Krillin. Okay. And yeah. the, the green guy. I always liked Piccolo. him. Piccolo. Okay, I loved Piccolo. He yeah. was awesome. Oh, Piccolo's in that live action movie. Oh, is he? Ha! <laughs> Yeah, he's green. He's like, from what I hear, though, he's uh, from what I hear, though, he's only um in it for like five minutes. I, I don't even want to think about the animation and that, but it, no, it was real, dude. They just they just painted oh, him green. You're shitting me. <laughs> no, I'm not. Oh my god. They just painted him green. That's like you know finding a really anorexic guy to play Gollum and putting him in a loincloth. It's just not putting forth any effort. Yeah. But, uh, I mean, who knows, though? It might become one of those Napoleon Dynamite-type films that's so... No, cool. it won't. You don't think so? <laughs> no. Napoleon Dynamite sucked, though. I mean, yeah. Oh, I mean, I, and I, I, I always I mean, it movie. sucked. And this, this from, what I, from what I understand, it sucks in the sense that you'll enjoy it because you'll get a good laugh out of it. Well, I mean, oh, Dragon Ball or Napoleon? Yeah, Dragon Ball. Yeah, well, Napoleon, Napoleon was... sucked. Yeah, I mean, I didn't find it funny, but I, I understand that... I guess I can see where some people enjoy it. I, I have always thought it was kind of just low-brow, stupid, junior high humor. Crap. Yeah, but... I lost brain cells watching that movie. That's true. I, listen, to, listen to me here. Do not, for whatever you do, do not watch that movie. You'll become stupid. Yeah, don't watch that. You'll Napoleon. become Napoleon Dynamite. <laughs> I mean, the moments that are supposed to be awkward and funny are just awkward and bad. I mean, only, yeah. you know, it's the... It's just bad. But moving on, uh... Want me to name one this time? Yeah, name something weird. Alright. Um, I'm pissed off about this, and you know what it is. Fuck Gynax. What's Fuck them in? and their YouTube banning ways. Oh, yeah. What, what is up with that, by the way? Is that trying um, to hoard... I don't really know. Maybe they're trying to create a certain image, and they think you're going to damage it, but... I still... get... I, what? I mean... The fuck, dude? Think of it this way. Think of this way. Okay. I'm creating that abridged, right? Yeah. yeah, I'm creating a bridge series. Yay! Off of Eva, the new Watch ones. it, by the way. Yes, it's hilarious. It's not even done yet, but it might not get done at this it, rate. He'll get it done. Don't worry. But uh, what but, what do you think they're doing it for then? If it's if it's not to save all the propaganda, you know. Well, I you know it it just doesn't make any sense to me because they started out before they were at an actual animation studio. They started out as a they made fan animations. Yeah. They took stuff. Their first few films, Diacon, the Diacon films, is what they were called. They're mini shorts featuring all tons of pop culture references. Darth Vader, Spider Man. So crap. they were they were lowbrow. They were no, they're actually they were pretty highbrow for the time. Oh, were they? Yeah, they, they they did they did some really good stuff. I yeah, actually, if you can find yourself a laserdisc copy of those movies, you are loaded. Pretty those good, are worth huh? those are worth like ten thousand a piece. Well, they were only released on Laserdisc. I agree with you in that I don't understand. I mean, you'd think that you making all this hype about it would increase the interest. Yeah. So I don't really understand it, but... No, on YouTube they're just taking off all images for rebuild. That's it. They, they don't even care about the original series now. They're just they like, don't care. fuck the original, we're sticking with rebuild. Which well, is the new ones, in case you're curious, yeah, well, and I'm, you guys are. I've, got the, I, I I've got the idea that they're revamping... Which, you know, from what you told me, so far they're doing a good job. Yeah, they're doing great. But I love the second one, dude. The second one's good. a fucking amazing dude. Well, uh, I've seen the original two, and they were they were good. But yeah, the original movies are good. But I, I do agree that the animation could be improved upon. So I guess but you've I seen, see you've seen some scenes from the newest one just a little bit ago. Yeah, the animation is it's stunning, and it wasn't even in high def, but it's no, still it's, stunning. Yeah, high def is amazing. Yeah, you're gonna have, we're gonna have to watch it sometime. But, well, Funimation, they're releasing they're releasing them here. Yeah, because Funimation owns everything now. Yeah, they pretty much do. I mean, from uh, from Black Cat to Dragon Ball. Yeah, to Dragon. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the, well, they, to God Save fucking, Our King. It's they they own everything. 